guys welcome back to the channel thank you so much for clicking on this video my name is stephanie they also are my sisters desiree and edith hopefully i don't mess up this time Please. with the names apparently i put desiree twice for today's after the theater reaction well like after theater thoughts uh we came to see the king's mm -hmm. man um this is the prequel to uh the not the Kingsman, the third in the franchise, but technically it's the first one. Um, a official third part has been um, announced, so it's exciting. That's they're supposed to start filming that September of next year, but it's gonna it's coming, you guys. We are gonna get a part three. We are getting um, XZ back, so I'm excited for that. Uh, so again, this is the prequel. How you know uh, the Kingsman kind of came again. to be. Uh, we are. Back in 19, I don't know, we're in wartime, you guys, okay? Like 1912. 1912? Yeah, because that very first scene without the spoiler when he was little mm -hmm. was 1902, and it said 12 oh. years later. So, so 19, 1914. Oh, I, 19 I, need, I need to do my math. Okay, well, let me read y'all the synopsis. Uh, one man must race against time to stop history's worst tyrants and criminal masterminds as they get together to plot a war that could wipe out millions of people and destroy humanity uh, once again it is directed by matthew vaughn who is the one who directed the first um two movies so that's great because we do have those great like action uh shots here he has a very like kind of unique way of how he films it it it, it, it gives it a little some some extra we're not gonna go too too much into this review because it is pretty late and i gotta go to work tomorrow y'all know i ain't about that like staying up like you know type of deal so um what are y'all thoughts on the film i liked it i i like to see the how it came to be there are some parts very unexpected i was so invested into into the movie i was like oh my god what's gonna happen i thought a lot of people were gonna die people that died i was not expecting to die i was like I enjoyed it also. Uh, same thing. I was very invested on certain characters and was shocked. I was like, <gasps> the whole theater. Yes, the whole theater. Oh, you're curious. Yes. <laughs> yeah. It's nice to see. I guess the origin of it. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> what? what? <laughs> I just remembered. Did y'all see those in that family that they just got up in the middle of I the was, movie and left? I, I was gonna mention that on my part. The one I kept noticing was the guy that was watching football. I love watching this trilogy. I love the action scenes. The those fight scenes are are amazing, and some of those stunts are mm -hmm. like wow. But uh, I'll keep it short because I'm tired and I gotta get these two. Yeah. Two. And I know she rants a little bit. Yeah, I know. I think short and this could be forever today. Um, so I didn't enjoy it as much. I know Desiree's like a huge fan of the Kingsman movies. I enjoy the movies as well. Um, I'm gonna actually do a little ranking um after we're done. I don't know if y'all gonna do it, but I'm gonna do mine. I'm gonna do like a separate video. I should have done that honestly with Spider-Man because I have not had a chance to do my Spider-Man <laughs> rankings yet, you guys. I didn't enjoy this one as much. I feel like it focused way more on the war part of it um, instead of like the put together of the Kingsman. Like I was expecting way more origin towards the Kingsman and then kind of whatever they were finding to kind of be on the side and it was kind of backwards of what I what I expected from it um you you, you don't really I didn't well I didn't really feel like that spyish type tone to it like I did with the other two yeah. um it's definitely different from the other two movies they'll still have a nice uh, uh some action scenes um not as much as fail as the other two movies um most of them are of course they're in the third act um it is a lot of build up to get to that particular deal i also had at that whole shocking moment in that particular thing that they're talking about because i was not seeing that coming honestly like right before that thing happened i go mm -hmm, but you wanted this Oh, that was a kind of a spoiler. Okay, okay, <laughs> I'm trying to avoid saying it, and you just let out say it. Yeah, I'll bleep it out. So I totally understood when that family got up and like left because I was like, I kind of want to go with y'all. I don't think it's a movie that I would watch again. 
um, unless I guess I'm doing like another ranking of it. Uh, maybe I guess when part three comes out, maybe I'll revisit it at that particular point, but maybe not even then. Not one that I particularly would recommend either. I think my favorite character here was Rasputin. Rasputin. <laughs> the Russian. Oh, yeah. He was awesome. Like, he was like fighting. Like, yeah. his fighting scene was like the best Dance. one. Yeah, because yeah. he was doing like a whole Russian like ballet deal to it. And when he was feeling the leg, that was so funny. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really wish that we had got more of him. Like, I, I would have wanted a little bit more utilization from that particular character. Guys out there, maybe we should bring the suits back in. Because suits are hot, you guys. Yes, Especially are. if you get like a nice, really fitted suit. Like, get a fitted suit. that double-breasted jacket. Yes, let me just tell y'all right now. A villain, a bad guy in a suit, bossing people around. That's the way to go instead of like trying to be all thuggish with your like baggy ass shit and do no 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 a suit brings more power let me tell you this this is uh <laughs> look let me put some fashion into your life and get you up to a whole other level um that way you can blend better with society okay um people are gonna be like Stephanie I don't care a suit you guys a suit put the pants up Put a belt on and put some fitted clothes on. Stop trying to look Nobody all thuggish. Wants to see your underwear. No, this is a way. Look, you can kick ass in a suit too. Let me. John Wick. Bam. 007. You run. Elijah. You run less risk of uh, having your pants fall off. Yes. <laughs> Before I do give you my score, and my ranking. Uh, if you haven't already, go ahead and give this video a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time that I post something new. Go ahead and let me know down below what did you think about the movie. Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Are you going to skip on it? How do you rank this one within the other two movies? Are you excited for the official third part? Secret. I don't know what's it's called. Call. I'm over here calling it a secret. I'm going to start off with me first. Small. Medium. Medium. Order of ranking uh, would be this one. The Kingsman. Oh shit, I That's was like, my is, is it the cops? <laughs> <laughs> they coming after us. The Kingsman, um, the Secret Circle, mm -hmm. and then, no, see. Yeah, the Secret Circle. Circle? It's the Se second part. And then what's the first one called? The King, well, it's just called King Kingsman and something. I was gonna call it the Order of the Phoenix. <laughs> no, the Order of the Harry Potter. Maybe I should have been more prepared. Okay, so, the Kingsman, the the Kingsman, <laughs> Kingsman, the Golden Circle, and then of course the very first one, Kingsman, the Secret Service. That was awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same work. That's how mine. Yeah, yeah the same. Yeah, the, the first part is my favorite. Yeah, first one. It's a, I actually just rewatched it again today, which technically you don't even have to because it has something to really do. It's a prequel, so the only thing that's the same would be the the tailor, um, sure. the shop. Yeah. That would be the only thing. That is it from us today. Until next time, see you guys at concessions. Bye.